Number one for New Country, 98.1 KHAK, Brandon Cortland, Bob and Danielle in studio as well. It's time for Who in the K-Hawk Crew? Woo! Oh, we're all excited to find <laughs> out. <laughs> oh, nervous. Always nervous. Why are you nervous? nervous. I'm just kidding. It's a lot know. of fun. It yeah. sounded good. I love throwing one of us under the bus. Usually it's me and Brain, so <laughs> and we'll see. I, I was Dre. gone last week and I still got yeah, thrown under the bus. You did. <laughs> Well, was, you did have a say, though, because you got to text in your answer. It was funny because I was taking my kids to school as you guys were playing, and I listened in to hear what you were saying, and I go, I really can't disagree with anything. <laughs> so it was fair, I admit. Uh, what is our question today, Corlin, that we'll be pondering and discussing? Are you ready? I don't think so. Okay. <laughs> Who in the K-Hawk crew would you trust the least to take care of your kids? <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Us who has children, uh -huh. he gets the first vote. So, uh, Brain, really the, get the only vote. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys have pets, and those are kind of like your kids, and my dog yeah. is kind That's of like true. my child, and I trust very few people to take first, care of him. Oh, Let me wow. preface this by saying <laughs> I would have no problem with either any of you yes. coming over and watching. I my like kids. that Agreed. you looked me in the eye when you said that. <laughs> I feel like this Go ahead, Brain! Go I feel, ahead! I feel like this isn't going to be this long of a second. This is not going to be good. Um. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, act like you're debating about it. <laughs> Good one. Cortland. We all know that you're a liar. No, I'm, just, I'm, I'm gonna go with Cortland. Why? <laughs> but why? I wanna know why. Why? Because I knew that I was gonna be chosen for this the second that I picked the question, but I, I have no reason as to why everyone thinks I'm terrible and listen, children. And listen, I will come to your defense as well because you have babysit many kids before when you were younger. I was a professional babysitter when I was 11. I didn't know there was a pro league for that, but I had a is. flyer. <laughs> she still got the license. Oh, God. I, so I don't know. I mean, I, that, my first thought goes to you. Maybe it shouldn't. I think it probably goes to me because I'm single and I have no way of procreating at this time. <laughs> well, no, I mean, you know, I think people, though, they look at single people and they say, okay, this person isn't even close to having their own children. Yeah, but I mean... Whereas Danielle is engaged and she's got multiple dogs and then Bob James is married and they've got like 38 animals in their home. <laughs> so... <laughs> the number keeps growing. It does. I guess Every, it every does. time I see you a photo, I'm like, is that another cat? No. I mean, I, I will say this, I will say this too, that just because someone is loving and, and has tons of animals and stuff it means they're a caring and compassionate person obviously but taking care of an animal it's different it's nothing like I taking know. care mm -hmm. of a child you don't have to tell me that like the, i don't know <laughs> it's the hardest thing that you will ever do um and i can say this because i'm struggling to do it you know three times <laughs> over you know sometimes every day so i don't know like i said earlier i wouldn't have any problem with either with any of you coming over so but Cortland's my vote oh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. uh, I think Bob it. Danielle anyone else well, we already know that Bob yeah. voted for me so yeah I yeah I, I mean just I <laughs> I don't think it this is, is a no win situation it is I don't think it's your fault like you said I just think it's the point where you are in your life right now yeah, yeah. and I do better I think with older children young young children scare me like babies that's what I was gonna oh, yeah. say they really freak me yeah. out because I feel like I don't have any motherly instincts <laughs> like I I feel like you would be great with, yeah, like older kids, you guys could all watch Disney movies and like have fun together, but yeah. like baby babies, I think you would get a little like anxiety. Well, I've never had to take care of an infant before. Mm -hmm. My, you know, I was really young when my brother was born, so I'm not one of those siblings who had to raise their right. younger siblings yep. or anything right. like right. that. So I, I haven't really had to be around really young babies. And sometimes when I, when I hold a baby, I make them hand it to me while I'm sitting down first. Oh, I, I could see I you like that. calling a parent being like, they're coughing, what should I do? Like, you know, and like freaking the, you know, out over a little I baby. do like babies and I like mm -hmm. toddlers and I like kids. Um, I don't know if I <laughs> can necess if I necessarily have the skills to raise any at this point in my life, but hopefully someday. Yeah, you will. I think Cortland just voted for herself. I think, I think she I did. did. Who else I am I going to vote did. for? You know, I have to vote for myself. I don't have a choice. <laughs> what am I vote for? Brain, who's raising three kids? Now, nah, wouldn't trust you with mine. <laughs> you screw up your own kids. I mean, listen, you've heard all the stories. Maybe you wouldn't trust me with your kids. Gosh, you think you'd password protect his uh, Xbox account? Right now. Okay. Well, I guess it's me then. Yay, don't yeah, trust yeah. me with your children. Could you bring in your babysitter flyer tomorrow? too by the way we'd all love to see it. I used I used PowerPoint to make it it had cool clip art on it and everything. 